Hello and good evening from the Pentland Hills, just outside Edinburgh. I'm meeting up with a couple of YouTubers tonight. You may have seen them already. It's Gaz Explorers and Steve's Wild Camping. They left at four o'clock. I'm an hour behind. I left just before five there. And I'm coming in from Florston. They came in from Freakmuir. I wasn't actually sure if this trip was going to go ahead. It was many be widespread rain and thunderstorms all weekend. Well, it's been relatively dry and uh, it's hardly been any rain at all. It is very hot and clammy though, so I wouldn't be surprised if there was a little bit of thunder and lightning. And if there is, I'll be straight off that hill. Uh, it's only about 420 metres high, the one we're camping on. So I shall bring you back further on. Right, I have left the reservoir back there. I'm now on the hill path and I'm less than a kilometre away from the summit. And still need to collect water though. And there's maybe a stream just to my left. So I'm hoping to get past these trees and I should collect from that. This here is what I'm aiming for. And I'm hoping Stevie and Gary will be up there. Let's find out. My little stream is here somewhere. I can hear it. But I can't see it. In there. It's way down there. Nightmare. There is some water here. Just find a nice little pool. Looks pretty clear actually. Chuffed to that. Alright, panic over. Is it just me? Are you always just a little bit apprehensive until you pick up your water for the night? Next challenge is to get pitched before the rain comes because the cloud is starting to get a bit darker. I spy with my little eye a red hilleberg and a head popping up. Oh, tent number two. There's wee guys. There they are. Happy days. How are you, Brett? Hey, Robin. How are you? How's it going? How's it going, lads? How's it going, lads? Been here long? Yeah, an hour I would say. An hour? An hour. Uh, I thought it'd be about an hour behind right, you. Yo, that's the tent up. Well, it's been up for a while actually because uh, it's just been gabbing to Gaz and Stevie there. There you go. I'm just waiting for the uh, stove to boil for dinner. So I'm surrounded by Hillebergs. That seems to be quite common. So Gaz has got the solo. What, is it? what have you got again, Stevie? The man's too. The Nange too? The Mange. The Mange? Yeah, too. Don't know if you heard that there. So Stevie here has got the exact same camera as me, the ZV-1, but it's a menu system you don't like, isn't it? Yeah, I'm uh, absolutely crap at it and I can it. There's only a couple of things I need set up. It's right from the start to the end. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'll have a look. <laughs> Let's have a wee look in your tent. Yeah, sure. Oh, that's pretty spacious in there, eh? Is that the party tent tonight? That's it, mate. <laughs> Don't know if you watched the video, but me and Gaz, we met over a year ago. We camped on Scald Law, literally, it was two, three days just before lockdown, eh? Yeah. And then Boris Johnson was out in the telly, boom, that was it. Last world camp for a good few months, anyway. Yeah, so I seems to be better now, right enough. Just beyond Gaz there, you've got, that's Castle Law, it was up there in winter. 
And you've got Alan Muir Hill just above his tent there. Got Scald Law, that's where we camped the last time. And I don't know if you can see it, but you can see the fourth road bridge, the new one. I shall zoom in. Yeah, there you go. These two are talking hillabergs, so I feel a little bit left out with the El Chipo Lanshan. Alrighty folks, it is half ten at night and uh, we've all retired to our tents because the rain has started. We Gaz is worried about the thunder though. Hey Gaz! Hi. <laughs> um, yeah, it was a big black dodgy looking cloud that sort of just scurried a few miles away from us. I never heard anything or seen any lightning so I don't think we've got anything to worry about but uh, yes, we'll see what happens during the night. I don't think Gary's going to get any sleep though. <laughs> Good morning campers. Oh, it's 20 to 6 and uh, yeah, went straight to sleep and then the rain hit hard at half 12 last night and that was me up for a good hour until the rain calmed down. But then when the rain went off I've been asleep since so it's not too bad. Well this is current scenes and the views. or lack of. Good night lads. Hi. Oh, that was Hi. great, really enjoyed it man, good. The rain woke me up. But... Aye, well he was snoring all the way through the rain. Yeah, Aye. Was that snoring? Aye, I thought it was thunder, eh? I was like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, here's the thunder. Aye. Yeah. I had to say, listen carefully, like, nah, it's just Stevie. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we're, we're lucky though, we missed the, the big rain. Aye, definitely. Right aye. over there, so we're lucky. But yeah, thanks to the clag, there's not much to show, so may as well wrap this one up, so I'll catch you later. Cheers. <laughs>